Welcome back to Don't Starve Random Giants, everybody. I need to get some freaking food. I am in uh, kind of bad shape right now. The penguins have overrun me. I'm hoping that we're going to make it through winter pretty soon here, but for now I need to focus on the fact that I have pretty much run dry on my food storage. So, things are not looking too great. I do have this ice as well. I don't, how, much, how much good does this ice do me to eat? I wonder if I can just... That's like two, two stomach units per ice cube, so... Maybe I should probably I should probably store those away. I'll I'll do that in a little while. But for now, I need to head down to the uh, to the food area, the area in which I can acquire food. I might actually try to kill some beefalo. See if maybe Abigail can handle that for me. But if I don't get something done here, my my situation looks kind of grim. So I need to need to get moving. Picking some berries along the way is not a bad idea either. And uh, I'm slightly tempted to go for the beehives, but. You know, the honey is really not the greatest source of nutrients either, so I'm thinking thinking some beefalo meat, maybe even the beefalo wool to create some more winter-type goods ought to help me out too, but man, this winter has been brutal. It has been unforgiving and ridiculous, and Glomer is really not helping that much, unfortunately. Uh, let's head over down here, though. I do want to check the uh, the traps. Apparently, the carrot that I left in the bait there did not do anything for me. Uh, let's have another look at the ones over by. Oh, actually, you know what? I should check the pig king because he might have some berries that I can pick. That would be very, very helpful, and uh, it may even be worthwhile to. Well, hold on a second. What can I do here? But if I attack this thing again, I don't know. I could get the. Uh, I could get all the pigs attacking the spiders, and then maybe I can place the uh, the spider eggs in a in a better position than I just did. So that's a possibility. Some monster meat acquired as well. There's the berry bushes, beautiful berry bushes. This will do just nicely here. If I can acquire a little bit more meat, I'll actually be able to construct uh, construct uh, cook up quite a few meatballs, which may solve my problem for a little while. At least until the winter passes on, and then we can start growing our own food again. That would be ideal. So, uh, yeah, that might be the, the direction I go here. Let's go ahead and start taking down this spider nest one more time. Oh, God, chilled to the bone again. All right, so maybe we're not going to do that just yet. Let's head back over to this campfire I know we have here. Oh, my goodness. This whole freezing thing is not helping out at all. There's our campsite. Okay, so let's go ahead and just put a board in here. Yep, that'll do. That'll do. Oh, hey, we actually got one. Fantastic. And I did want to make a Presta Hattitator as well, but I don't know. Pretty sure we need to uh, prioritize the fact that I need food badly. Bear needs food badly. Dark Gauntlet Souls don't legacy starve. Not sure why Dark Souls was involved with that. Um, oh, hey, look. Apparently this happened. Good. And then, uh, oh, you know what we need to do? I guess what happened is uh, we caught a rabbit, but it just kind of, you know, died. There's some monster meat up here as well. I'm willing to, I'm willing to sacrifice a bit of my, a bit of my health if it means picking up some stray meat around here. So we got three morsels now and a rabbit, which is pretty damn good as long as I stay warm. I am hurting myself a little bit, but what I could do. Oh god, I know, I know, man. Hang on, we're getting there. We're getting there. It's fine. It's fine, don't completely freeze over. We're good. We're good. Take that take that screen effect away. Right now. Right now. They thank you. Jeez. Okay. This thing needs to heat up. I think it might just need to stay here by the fire for a little while. Oh boy. Well I think we gotta Oh man. What can we do? I need four of them, don't I? I'm pretty sure I need four. So this is uh Hmm. Not looking like I'm gonna be able to keep this thing around. We're gonna make uh, three meatballs for sure, so that's good. I don't know. Uh, While well, I'll have my thermal stone, I might be able to whip up a torch and be able to make it all the way back to the campsite. That's probably my best bet. So let's do that now. We're gonna keep that in the inventory. We're gonna wait until this thing is piping hot. Glomer's gonna take a nap here, which is totally fine, and uh, then we're gonna make our way back to camp and cook up some meatballs. Call it good call it a successful expedition. In fact, I'm pretty sure I can just take this now. Let's go ahead and make our way out. Okay. Torch time. Wherever the hell I put that thing. There we go. And there was light! Yeah, she's very Shakespearean in her dialect. I love it. Mm-hmm. 
Hmm, uh, let's, yeah, we're gonna head all the way back up. I don't know if the buzzards are gonna help me out at all. I'm pretty sure I'm not gonna be able to utilize them at all. Could be worth a go, though. Maybe if I, uh... I think my... I'm pretty sure my health has something to do with the way the buzzards interact with me. That's something I should probably inspect a little bit further. If I'm, uh, feeling a bit under the weather to speak, uh, I would... or to, uh, you know, to... To boil it down to another pun related to the situation I'm in is really what I was looking for. What is this? Oh, seeds are good. Seeds are very good. Yeah, my uh, my health may be the uh, the factor that determines whether or not the vultures are interested in me. So, might be worth looking into. Look at all these cool things I've got over here. I dig this a lot. Right, do they have any eggs I can just pick up here? I don't think they do. Oh well. All right, we're halfway through the nightfall. Let's fuel this flame. There we go. We're going to take this torch out of my inventory and hopefully be able to, uh, oh, just kidding. We're going to, well, I mean, that'll work, I guess. Okay, time to cook up. Let's, uh, let's put you in here. Get some of those berries going. Bam, bam, bam. Okay. We solved the food problem temporarily and we have more penguins. That is absolutely unnecessary. I was really hoping we were reaching the end of the freaking, oh, God, please don't tell me you're making up camp right there. That is not okay. I am surrounded by penguins right now. This is really... Not looking good. Do have some meatballs, though, right? So I'm gonna have to eat these ones straight away. There we go. Delicious. Got two monster meats to use as well. There we are. And then I'm gonna keep this. Uh, I'm gonna keep this rabbit. Actually, I'm gonna try to keep this rabbit alive. Did I put this in here? I don't know. Probably not. Okay, I can't put it in the chest though, and that usually works. So we'll see how well that goes. Uh, he's probably gonna be dying of starvation, which totally sucks, but not really much we can do. Alright, apparently this, the uh, farms are completely useless at this point of the season, which makes sense. There's another meatball. We're going to put that in the fridge. Very good. And then whip up one more set. And if we can find a bit more monster meat somewhere, if we can happen to uh, Maybe kill a vulture up in this area, actually. That will give us the uh, the other morsel that we so desperately need. Our thermal stone is nice and toasty warm again. I'm going to pick up my torch and un immediately unequip it. There we go. All right, tell me they're going to walk further away. That would be really helpful right now. That would be very, very, very helpful. I might want to keep this meatball on my person, but then again, probably will do a lot better off inside of the icebox. Okay, so... What is... What is my objective? Maybe I should put this ice away. Let's go ahead and do that now. Although it's not melting, of course, since it's in the middle of winter. It's not really in danger of being discarded. Um... Man, I'm kind of worried about everything right now. I need three more rabbits if I want to make this thing happen, but I'm, I'm really not sure that should be my priority anymore. Let's see. Food. What can I do with food here? Uh, bee box. Could be good. Sounds like beatbox, which is pretty rad. Oh, uh, no other food sources, though. Man, survival? Do I have anything I want to make up in here? A pretty parasol could be fun. A fishing rod, maybe. A fishing rod? Do I have ponds nearby, anywhere? I don't know if I found any ponds yet. Maybe I should go exploring a little. That might be the worst idea in the world, though. Yeah, that's a contender for it, considering my, uh, my overall lack of resources. Where, what direction do I really need to go? This is all, this is all water over here, so really, this over the, in, in this direction is basically the only th thing I can explore still. And, uh, hope to find new goodies within. Making a hammer is probably a good idea, too. A hammer could help me out quite a bit. Let's go get a couple more twigs and then whip this thing up. We can take down some structures. Maybe get some marble or something like that. Get some cool goodies to use. Oh man, getting some eggs would be awesome as well. I feel like I may just need to try attacking the penguins again, although they can easily just wreck my shit, so that's that's a terrifying endeavor. I don't really know what other options I have at the moment. There's just so many penguins right now. It's absolutely ridiculous how many penguins there are. The penguin overload is real. I think I need to kill them. I think I need to start trying to kill them, and uh... To do that, we need our spear. We have a fire dart in here. I don't know if I want to try to use that. In fact, yeah, let's go ahead and give that a shot. See what happens. 
We're gonna equip this thing, and uh, I'm gonna attack him. There we go. All right, he's lit on fire. We'll see what happens there. All right, really nothing. Oh damn. Oh, and I'm getting cold again. God damn it. Uh, well, Abigail's still trying to do something. I can get my spear on again. Yeah, that didn't really help out at all, did it? Clear up some inventory space in the chest, at least, right? That's the goal. That's the objective. Hmm. You know what? I, I get it. I get it, Blommer. Pan flu. Hold on. Hold on. What if we, uh... Hmm. What if we lull them to sleep? They've got some eggs out right now. Right? I think they do. Oh, they don't. They took them all away, yep. As soon as I even get remotely close, that's... That's when they hide away their offspring. That's no good. Are the vultures trying to attack them? That would be good. Man. Yeah, it looks like he is. I wonder if... Ooh. Could I, like, lure the vultures down here and then we could have bird-based territorial warfare going on. Hmm. That is a possibility. I'm still starting to think, though, maybe I just want to try to desperately wait out the winter here. But I am, again, running low on food. I've got my one meal per day going strong right now. Huh. You know what? I'm going to chop down some trees because I know I need more of those. Definitely did not need more penguins. For the love of God! Oh, sorry for my nostrils, by the way, they're being silly. I'm gonna make an axe, because, uh, yeah, it's probably a good idea. Chop down the trees with style. Luxury axe. So we're gonna make a hammer as well, which we still should be able to do. Have I already made a hammer? I don't know if I have. I don't think I have. I don't remember making one. Maybe I found one somewhere, but anyway, time to use this. I'm going to pick up my thermal stone. I'm going to put a couple more logs on the fire. There we go. Let's chop down some trees. So, food is still of uh, the utmost importance right now. I, uh, I I don't know if I don't know if I'm safe to really venture beyond my comfort zone right now. I think, uh... I think I, I might just have to stay by the campsite. I'm pretty terrified to make any kind of crazy moves, although Abigail is a really good failsafe. I, I feel as though, as long as I don't do anything entirely foolish, Abigail is going to pretty much save the day. Regardless of what kind of enemies we come across. I need a couple more, uh morsels or monster meats at least in order to make better use of the berries that I already have. That much is a given. Still trying to get some more, uh, some more logs. Having more of those is never a bad thing. We've got some boards as well, which we might want to just use for the fire. Pretty much at any point. Some more, uh, oh goodness, what the hell? Whoa, what is this? What is this? Is this a tree monster? I think it is. Oh, shit. Oh, it definitely is. Yep, and Abigail's dead. What the hell? Hold on a second. Hold on a second. Yeah, that is... That is definitely a tree monster. Oh, God. Oh, God. That is... That is really uh, not necessary right now. <laughs> that is the kind of thing we did not need to run into at the moment. Where is Abigail's flower? I need to pick it up, right? I hope so. There it is. Oh my god. Well, that sucks. That does truly suck. I wonder if I can appease it. It's not attacking me right now, so I can only assume it's okay with my existence. Yeah. Okay. He reacted. I think he's happy enough with me now. Let's see. Can I plant them a little bit closer to him, maybe? We're still, uh... We're still in the cold harshness of the night. Oh, no. Well, goddamn pine cones, come on! There, okay, yeah, he's reacting to that. Yes. 
Uh huh. Yeah, he's fine. He's happy. We're gonna we're gonna live peacefully among one another. Although that does take away my options to chop down a lot of trees, unfortunately. Perhaps he uh, he won't see me twelve feet this way. <laughs> Hopefully that's the case. Hopefully I'm safe. We'll find out soon enough. My God, these nights. The night lasts longer than the day. This is crazy. I am not a fan of winter. My oh yeah, God, thank you. Thank you for taking away the logs at the last possible second. Holy shit. Okay, that's all right. That's all right. We're fine. Oh, I'm still hungry. I'm still gonna be hungry for so long. Yeah, well, we do have the tree guard nearby. I'm pretty sure no, uh, no other creature is is affected by the tree guard. So this is gonna be dangerous. Uh, losing Abigail is really bad right now too. Oh shit. Well, hmm. You can plant some more. Yeah, see? You're a fan of that, huh? Yes, you are. You like you like it when I make pine cones planted. That's that's a good thing, huh? That's a good thing. Let's do more. Okay, yeah, he's just gonna be plenty pleased with me. See, I I'm a man of the I'm a man of the earth. A woman rather. I know how to how to make things right according to Mother Nature. Now what do I want to do? Probably kill some more trees. Um, man, this winter is lasting a lot longer than I planned it to. I think I need to go uh, take a risk, going in the wormhole again. Although I think I remember where this one took me, and it was not helpful. So maybe not that way. Oh my God, that's enough penguins! That is enough penguins. I have had my fill of penguin. If they were easy to kill, I'd be all for it, but those dudes massacre me. Oh, holy shit. Bees on penguin breeding ground. Now I've seen it all. Ha ha ha. Oh my god, I don't I'm not sure. I'm not sure there's a way to make this work. I'm worried. I'm worried about how we're gonna live. I mean, berries, I guess, if we can find enough, we can just live off of those for a while, but at some point we're gonna have to find an alternative source of food. And I think it's going to involve me killing some, uh, harmless little critters. Those we'll find out. We could chop down some of these trees, actually. It's not a terrible idea. And get some birch nut wood going on. Maybe, at some point in my life. There we go, three logs for... 28 seconds of work, Jesus. Oh, and we're starting to freeze up already. Oh, man. This winter hat is not as useful as I wanted it to be, I'll tell you what. Another carrot is good, though. We can actually uh, more than likely make... make a semi-decent meal out of the carrots and berries combination. Oh, wow. Already into the evening of day 31. I'm really, really hoping we're on the, uh, the tail end of winter here. Oh my god. Alright, hold on a second. I need to at least make a campsite or something. We're gonna build a campfire here. Or we're just gonna have a freaking stupid crow interrupt it. There we go. So we can just chop down a few more trees, I guess. I need my thermal stone back, though. I'm gonna have to make it- I'm gonna have to make it back to the campsite. Yeah, I don't- I don't have a choice, man. I'm- I'm like stuck where I am. I think I needed to kill some beefalo. Fortunately, we lost Abigail, so that's going to be a lot less likely until she's back in action. Oh, man. Let's go ahead and put this thing down see if I can get that warm and ready for the, uh, for the journey. Yeah, I think, uh, what I need to do, I need to go back to camp. I probably want to sleep through the night. And then we're going to have a meatball as soon as I, as soon as I, uh, wake up again. And then... We will have to go down to Beefalo territory. And hope that we can, uh... Hope that we can at least kill one, get the meat from that guy, get the beefalo wool, hopefully, and maybe even a horn. Make some other cool stuff. Yeah, that's basically my, uh, my last chance for success. 
We're gonna add another fuel log to the fire here, and then probably have to make a torch. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to make it back, but I'm gonna try. Man, I wish I had a walking stick, too. At least I've got a companion, man. At least Glommer's here to make things less gloomy. Glommy, if you will. That could be bad. That does sound like it could be bad. What in the hell was that? I don't... I don't... I don't need this right now. I don't need a deep moan. All-encompassing. As I try desperately... To get back to my campsite. Oh my god. It's getting closer. Something just flew by the screen, but I'm pretty sure it has nothing to do with it. That's a killer bee, right? No, that's a regular one. Oh god. Oh god, okay, hang on. We're almost back. Oh, I don't like that noise. I don't like that noise! Please don't make it anymore. We're gonna make a fire. We're gonna be fine. Okay. Oh, Glomer, you kind of terrified me for a second there, buddy. Alright, um... If I go to sleep, nothing bad will happen, right? What the hell is it? Oh! Ho oh, ho! Oh no! Wow! What the hell? Oh my god! It killed Glomer! You killed Glomer, you terrible, terrible thing! What is this? Holy shit! Oh god, oh god, I'm dead. It took out, it took out everything. It took out the tent. Wow. Oh my god, please stop what you're doing. Ouch! Holy shit! What the hell was that? Oh my god! Well, at least I have some survival gear prepared in this chest, but Jesus Christ. That was insane. Oh no. Okay, um I mean, goddamn, what do I do about that? I I have not prepared for a giant to come destroy my entire campsite. That was that was the least among my concerns. Oh my god. I might be I'm I'm screwed. I think I'm screwed. I need some twigs. I'm gonna make a torch. I need to make a fire, honestly. Holy shit. I hope it didn't just, like, eat everything, too. That would be awful. Alright, I'm just gonna go ahead and make this get warm again. Oh my goodness. Is it coming back? I mean, I wouldn't be surprised. At least it left the resources behind, right? I I'm not really sure what to do if it took everything. I'm not sure that was its goal. I'm pretty sure it was just on a on a freaking path of destruction there. Okay, well, can I make it back? I don't know. I'm going to make a torch and hope that helps. I'm not sure it's going to. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I'm dead. I'm pretty much dead. Oh, God, I am completely freezing over. Can I make it? Can I make it back? I'm pretty close. I have a couple of logs. Oh god, please. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Oh, it's still there. It's still there. And it's... And it's just... It's just game over. Wow. And we got a thing! We got a character, I think. Well, that's good. Well, I mean, relatively speaking. Wow. Okay. Well, that sucks. Thanks for watching. We'll have to, uh, we'll have to try out a new character, I think. See you then.